My purpose in making this film is to share a musical journey with you, maybe an artistic journey. Some people call me an artist. I say, sure, I'm an artist. I'm into the art of living. My name is Chris Corso. In order to keep my story simple and focused, I will only tell you that I'm a human being in search of truth. Jazz has helped me toward that end. I just wanted to mine the music for its pure essence, truthful vibrations, and let them flow into other parts of my life. I had no intention of playing out with other musicians or recording or making money with it. I just wanted to explore the oscillating vibrations. That's why I'm into jazz. This is Chris Corson. I mean, I, I have no other friend like him. Chris is remarkably uncluttered. I really look forward to my morning piano exercises. It's very zen. He's just got a, he's got a very unique way of looking at the world and it's, uh, it's beautiful and it's interesting and it's insightful and it's, it's wonderful, you know. It's funny, playing this piece called Timeless, I have no sense of time. It's just now. Time less, time more. It's a great place to be. So, I should introduce you to my teacher, Arlette McCoy Ekstrand. I answered an ad in the jazz newspaper. It said, learn hip chord changes without years of studying. Call Arlette. Arlette sounded black over the phone. I signed up. Hey, Chris, how are you? That's my teach, Arlette. Ain't she something? Uh, Matt, yeah, hey, how you doing? Come on in, I just made some coffee. Hey, Chris? Yeah, yeah. Hey, man, what's going on? I do know jazz has certainly opened up some doors for me. I know on an intellectual level, jazz is an American musical art form. But on an emotional and spiritual level, what is jazz? Or more appropriately, where is jazz? joining in with me and making this thing spontaneously happen, we both have landed in jazz. In my quest to find the truth through the music, the journey took me to New Orleans, the city where jazz was born. In those moments, I found the truth in jazz.